Hey guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode three of Love Live DJ Kasaki School Idol Club. So let's go. Did I just? Yeah, did I say it right? Mhm. Mm I think I did. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. <laughs> Um, Setsuna is, you know, our focus today. Alright, so Miss Setsuna Yuki. Um, of course, but you know you weren't able to. So, I mean, but it's your dream. She's so hard headed. That's what I remember about her. I mean, okay. So, let's go ahead and talk about the shock now. Um, so, when the game came out in JP and when I was playing it and everything, I was expecting us to find out about her at least chapter two or chapter three no we found out in chapter one and everybody was on twitter screenshotting and everything i'm sitting there playing the game and i was like oh you kind of look like pansy from um i can't remember the name of the show right now are you are you the only one who really likes me that's the show i was like yeah you kind of look like pansy and i was like okay so you kind of got a secret right i was like it's kind of obvious that you do so when she took her hair out i was like oh you're so pretty and she still is she's not my best girl i do love her uh the day her um <clears throat> her uh her fest card yeah yeah, yeah their love life fest card Came home, came home on a single pool. Best day ever for me. Because I was expecting, like, I or any other non-fest girl to come home. But no, she was like, yeah, I'm coming home. And it's a pretty card. Probably one of the prettiest artworks. And especially when you use it with her signature song. Mwah. Oh, I like her suitcase though. It's pretty. Mm. But you can't hide who you are just throwing away. So even though her, we now know her name as Nana, I'm still going to call her Yuki or Sasana. I'm just a cutie patootie though. Travel maker. A uh, kitty. <laughs> oh, oh, my God, your tail. <laughs> an exception. A baby. You so cute. Hmm? 
Pardon? No, you. Mm -hmm. Us. Well, no. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's fine. Of course. But funny thing is you're talking to her right now. Well. <laughs> you. I mean, yeah, it was, but it just felt like... Hmm. Hmm. Babe. But I would've. But, you know what, let me say this. It's okay to butt heads with other people. Because not everybody's going to want to agree with you. Yes, you're going to fight, and that's okay. No matter how many fights you had with them, it doesn't matter. So now what? This is something that she really truly has to think about. I mean, if she really loves singing, 
just as much as any of the other council presidents have in the past. Don't give it up. Yeah. Comments. Even seeing her reading comments kind of reminds me of like when I started four years ago and how I hated mean comments. It was either that or like the road just to getting to 100 subscribers. Like that was the worst thing for me. And I was very close to quitting, but I, I kept going. And no matter how many times I got copyright checks after copyright checks after getting my channel terminated like two times, and I'm still here. And you still continue on because if you love it, you continue no matter what. Kisumi. <laughs> As though you should always check your phone. Mm -hmm. I mean, but hold on. Who else can get through to her but herself? I mean, you girls are all trying your best. Don't get me wrong. But I just think it's it's a her problem. She has to figure it out herself and what she truly wants. I don't think she does. I think right now she's just... <laughs> oh, Emma. Exactly. Yeah, I mean, well, come on. It's just going to be hard no matter what, but that's okay. She has experience in it. So you take it with tough criticism and have fun with it still. So. It would start to get sunny at like two minutes to four. <laughs> <laughs> Cotton's right. But it's the truth, though. <laughs> I mean, she's not saying it to be mean, she's saying it to be truthful. Of course, the us has to talk. The kitty! Oh, well, that's.
that's good. <laughs> Well, dang, I mean, just like that. <laughs> Kasumi, how to win people over with food. <laughs> I wasn't expecting this part to be the roof. I was expecting like we had like one more level, but okay. For you to join back. No, wait, wait, wait. She still has something else to say. No, that's not true. Well, because you're passionate, you're strong, determined, you don't take no for an answer, you really say that in your songs? If she wasn't, she wouldn't be up here with you, right? I mean... Mm-hmm. Who are you gonna take? She is! Aww. Literally a completely different person. Completely different aura. I mean, okay. It makes sense for her to sing not once but twice. But it's good. So wish that they had subtitles though because I mean oh my god as much as this is a really pretty music video would love to see what she is saying but no we gotta wait for them fan translations right and who knows how long that could take 
one thing I also am hoping for this, like, each girl has, like, a signature outfit. Not very similar to the ones that they have for, um, All Stars, but, like, this one for Sasuna, the one for Kasumi, the one for Ayamu. I want these freaking outfits in the game. By the time we get to the last episode of this series, it needs to be in the game. Whether it's in the gacha or anything else, put it in the game. That's all I want. Or as a free gift. I mean, y'all giving us like candy and gems and um, what are those things called? I don't really remember the name right now. But yeah, outfits would be nice. I mean, because like I'm trying to save my gems and I am the worst at saving gems because any time when something new pops out, I'm like, I would immediately spend my gems. <laughs> but no, your girl is trying to save for this series. And plus, Idol Master and Banzeri, I play too many gacha games. And I'm adding a new one that officially starts later on today or tomorrow. But it was a good performance. Something tells me Cotton is going to be the next focus. so much still not my best girl but just her upbeat and like her personality I just love her so much she's a cutie but duty and she's just adorable but mm, you gotta love her if you don't love Satsuna Yuki you have problems like mm. I know so many girls who were just like well girls and guys who were so freaking happy to finally hear this girl sing. And I remember like so many people were like, I love the crap out of Chase. And I heard it one time and I was like, yeah, this is a really damn good song. I mean, it's super duper good. I haven't heard the other solo song that she has. Cause like I am behind on the English version of the game. Cause I barely really play it sometimes, but I'm trying to play as much as I can with all the other gacha games that I'm playing, as I said, I am adding another one officially today because I think um, the things for it officially open because it should be past 12 in Japan. I'm not 100% sure. Let me check. It is... No. It's 5 a.m. there, so it ain't 12 o'clock yet. But yeah, this is a really good episode. I think Curved Music Video, as out of the three, was the prettiest. I love, like, the underwater scenery, because your girl likes water and scenery and ish like that. Ayamu's was, like, a typical cute, girly, girly, pretty. No, it's Ai's turn! Aww. <laughs> I thought it would be a third year, but okay, I'm fine with that. That's good. Super duper good because I, that means, okay, then Rena's going to be after I, that has to be it. It's going to be then Rena, no, I, Rena, and then Shizuku, I believe, and then our third years. So, you know, my best girl is somewhere in there. You know, she coming, just can't tell you when, whenever she decides to pop up and say, hey, this episode is finally about me. I mean, but yeah. The, her music video, Sisyphus was like literally the prettiest one. Ayamu's is more like the typical, kind of gave me like bubblegum pop feels or no, you know what? Let me take that back. Kasumi's is more of a bubblegum pop feel while um, Ayamu's is just like the traditional pop, maybe like Ariana Grande or um, any other pop artist that I love listening to all the time. But like both, all three opening, I mean, uh, music videos were good as hell. It shows their unique style and what 
they want to be known for. But still, them outfits. I just want them outfits. <laughs> and all I want are these outfits, especially like Ayamu's, because Ayamu's is so pretty. I mean, Kasumi's was gorgeous as heck too, but like Ayamu's, like... Even though Ayamu, like, she she had me there, like, in that first episode. I almost was about to say, like, damn, Ayamu might, be ha- might have to be my best girl. Until later on that night, I realized who my best girl was and is. And, of course, when she comes, and it's like, yeah, there's my best girl. But Ayamu really had me in that first episode. I was like, damn, like, this girl is literally best girl material for me, for this group. And she, like, it was so close. But then, you know, my best girl was like, uh-uh, and like, no. I'm actually your best girl. You know I am. And then I was like, yeah, you're right. I was like, because you're so similar to me. And I love her so much. And so when we get to the week of when she has her scout, I'm probably going to scout for her because there is like one outfit of hers that I really, really want. And I don't think it's out yet. I think if I say the name, that is really going to spoil. So I'm just going to wait until we get to the day or the week that she gets the focus on. But yeah, it was a really good episode and I'm glad, you know, she's Nana Setsuna Yuki is finally a part of the group. But other than that, guys, that was my reaction view towards episode three of Love Live Nijikasaki School Idol Club. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode four. Bye, guys.